Welcome or welcome back to my channel. I have a very exciting video for you guys today. It is Christmas season. I feel like Bath & Body Works just skipped Thanksgiving and went straight to Christmas. This past weekend, Bath & Body Works had a $2.95 hand soap event and that's pretty cheap. I wish I had the paper coupons to add onto that, but that's a really good deal for hand soap. I got some Christmas stuff when they did their 40% last month, I believe, and I'm really excited to show you guys my haul, so let's head on to this video. The first scent that I have is the Champagne Toast. This is my all-time favorite scent behind Cactus Blossom. And I'm really glad they made it in a Christmas packaging. I feel like this is a lot of other people's favorite scents as well. I love the design. It's an, an all white aesthetic and gold design. I also like the small detailing on the top of it. There's silver snow falling on the top and on the side. The champagne toast smells like champagne and sparkly berries. If you had to choose a scent to get for Christmas, I really recommend this. It smells so good and the packaging is just so aesthetic. I only saw this in the cleansing gel hand soap. I haven't seen the champagne toast in the foaming hand soap, so they have the Christmas packaging just for the cleansing gel hand soap. Next hand soap I got is the frosted coconut snowball. I got it because it's penguins. Penguins are my favorite animal. Not my favorite scent, but I really love the design. This was the only scent that had penguins on it, so I had to get it. I was thinking of when I was done with this scent, I could just refill it with another scent that I really like. The Frosted Coconut Snowball smells like a mix of coconut and vanilla. The Winterberry Ice smells like a liquid cherry medicine, but smells like it in a good way. And it's also kind of strong, so keep that in mind. But the packaging is really pretty. The next scent I have is the Fresh Sparkling Snow. This comes in a really nice teal aesthetic. And this one smells like a mix of pear and melon. I have never seen this scent before until this season. I think this is a new scent for the season, or maybe I just haven't seen it. This one's the Mahogany Apple. The apple's barely there. I smell more of the mahogany teakwood. This isn't a Christmas scent, but I always have to get it for my mom. I have the Japanese cherry blossom. It comes in its original design. It smells like cherry blossom, pear, and sandalwood. The packaging of this was so pretty. I had to get it. This is the ice blue lavender. It comes in this really nice teal packaging. This one smells like a woody cologne. The next scent I have is the white iris and cedar wood. Out of the whole Christmas collection, this is my favorite scent. It comes in this nice green packaging. This packaging is similar to the ice blue lavender. I really like the color of it. It's more like pastel color. This one smells like iris blossoms and cedarwood. Besides champagne toast, I would really recommend getting this for your Christmas collection if you had to choose one. I just realized a lot of my favorite scents have blossom in it. Like this one has iris blossoms in it and my other favorite scent is cactus blossom and that one has cactus blossom in it. Wild Lavender Mint is the next hand soap I have. This one smells like lavender by the sea. They were advertising the next three I have in the front. The first one I have is the Coastal Cove. This one smells like flowers in the hotel by the sea. I feel like this is something a hotel would have in its like bathroom. The design is very hotel-y. There's like leaves. It looks like flowers by the sea in a hotel. Bright Skies is the next hand soap I have. This one smells like apples and pears. It really comes in a nice light blue color. I really like how they packaged it so you could see like the color through the hand soap holder. The pink apple punch smells like a mix of apple and melon punch. I would also recommend this scent. This one smells really good, very refreshing and tropical. The last hand soap I have is this Kitchen Mandarin. I haven't seen this set in their classic collection, so I wanted to try it. This one smells exactly like mandarins. I also have the clear bags at Bath & Body Works as well as their little ribbon. Now we are moving on to our Christmas car scents and look how cute their Christmas bags are. So cute. The first one I have is the Fresh Balsam. This smells exactly like balsam. Very foresty. The next scent I have is Tis the Season. This is a very Christmas scent. This smells like a mix of cinnamon and apple with like a hint of like wood, like cedar wood to it. I got a bunch of these in their hand soaps last year when it was on sale and it does get a little bit tiring. The next scent I have is the Winter Candy Apple. This smells like a mix of apples and pears, but very Christmassy. And the last car scent I have is this Midnight Snow. I don't know how to describe this, but they describe this as berry, cedar wood, and lavender. Those are the four car fragrances that I got. I didn't see this online but I saw it in stores. Look how cute it is. I wish they had a penguin one. I have the light up penguin from last year but they didn't really have any penguin hand soap holders from this year but the snowman was really cute. I think this one would match like a white hand soap to match the aesthetic. No maybe it needs like a full size hand soap. Oh so cute. Yeah I definitely use a full size hand soap to match with the aesthetic. Look how cute it is. I really like hand soap holders like this because when it gets wet, it won't like rust. This is made out of like something like that doesn't rust. Anyways, this doesn't rust. I really like getting hand soap holders that aren't made out of metal and you can reuse this for future years to come. I really like the white aesthetic of it and it's very sparkly, which I really like. The next two things I got are penguins. Look, they're penguin hand sanitizer holders. I got a penguin for the gel hand sanitizers and I got one for their sprays. 
The next one I have is this really cute Santa gnome. Doesn't he look like a gnome? He's more Santa, but he really looks like a gnome to me. And it says Santa nice list. And this one comes with this little bell that you can ring. I used my birthday present on this winter candy apple body cream and my free reward on this winter candy apple body scrub. Definitely sign up for a reward because when you get enough points, you can get a free $16.50 item for free. For their birthday reward, you get an item of up to $8.50 for free with the purchase. So I got these two to match for my apartment. The next thing I got were the Christmas wallflowers. This one has a green star design all around it. I don't know if I like it anymore now that I see it in person, but I wanted to see how it would look like in real life compared to online. I really like this tree one though. It looks very realistic. I hope. I think it looks realistic. And this one, I don't think this one lights up, but this one does. This one lights up, but this one doesn't. This one's so pretty. Look at the detailing for it. So it has like the little reindeers on top and if you look through the windows you see like santa claus and then on this window you see like a christmas tree there's this projector right here so when you plug it in it will like light up and it will say dear santa on it and it will have like the designs around the dear santa the next thing i got is their strawberry snowflakes they were doing a promotion a few weeks ago you get this for free with any purchase it's not my favorite scent this smells like a really really sweet strawberry i'm probably going to exchange it for another scent i really like their packaging for this though it's in a very nice pink color on to our christmas hand sanitizers the first one i got is in the winter candy apple i got these online when they were doing 40 percent off so for five of these it came out to about 96 cents each which i thought was a really good deal so i got a whole bunch of christmas and fall scents this is the packaging for the winter candy apple the next thing i got is the champagne apple and honey this one you can use for like winter fall or just every day like throughout the year now we are on to my christmas pack this one is a pack of five the first scent i got is the frozen lake this one smells like a winter cologne this pack also comes with a winter candy apple i don't really like the sweet scents this one is the vanilla bean noel i think this one smells like the vanilla bean frap from starbucks the next one I have is the gingerbread bakery. This one smells like gingerbread and spice mixed together. This also isn't really my favorite one. And the last one I have is the twisted peppermint. This one comes in a dark pink packaging and this one smells exactly like peppermint. That was all I had for my Christmas haul. The rest of the stuff I got is from the beginning of October. So there might be still a little bit of Halloween stuff in there. We'll start with this five pack of fall scented hand sanitizers. This one is the rainbow cereal. I have never seen this scent before. So I was so amazed when I saw this in the pack. The packaging is so pretty. It really reminds me of cereal. It's in this nice light pink color and it's very fall. And this one smells like Fruit Loops. The next one I have is the marshmallow pumpkin latte. This one is in a really nice design. The inside is purple. It's like a mix of purple and brown. This one isn't really my favorite scent. This one smells like a really sweet marshmallow pumpkin. The next one I have smells like a fall pinecone potpourri. This one is the pumpkin apple this is perfect for thanksgiving and fall the next one is so punny this one is the you float my boat and this one is in the scent fall lakeside breeze the scent really matches what it says it is this one smells like crisp leaves and cologne by the lake this is in the scent cranberry peach and this one smells like cranberries at thanksgiving dinner the last hand sanitizer i have to show you guys is in the stars this is one of their classic scents that they just brought out this smells like cologne and perfume all in one it's like a mix of sandalwood and flour i got hand sanitizers holder at the pumpkin pie one which is perfect for thanksgiving and i saw on like tiktok and like reels and stuff that people like Put the pumpkin pie together so it makes like one whole pie and same thing with the pizza for this one if you put it all together it makes like a whole pizza and for this one if you put it all together it makes a whole pumpkin pie so i thought that was so cute these were 40 percent off of seven dollars the next hand sanitizer holder that i got is this birthday hat so whenever it's your birthday you can put this on your keychain and the last one i got is this ombre hand sanitizer spray holder i got this white marble wallflower when it was on sale to match with the white aesthetic of my apartment this one has scent control but it doesn't light up i got two candles i think this one i got for free with my rewards i have a lot of rewards at bath and body works so i got the fall and bloom i really like the scent for this as well as the packaging this smells like a mix of plums, flowers, and berries all in like one perfume. I would really recommend this if you ever get a chance to try it. I got the vampire blood because I wanted something to match my Halloween aesthetic even though it's not Halloween anymore. This one smells like strawberry, jasmine, and plum. The scent is really good along with the enchanted candy potion and I really like the design for the top of the lid. I really like how they did the red wax because it really represents Halloween. It says butterfly. Okay, I think I remember what I got. So I got my best friend this for Christmas because she's been wanting this. This was 40% off, so I got her this butterfly hand soap holder. There's also these holes at the bottom, so it drains out the water, which I really like. That's all I had for my Christmas haul and everything that I got in October and November. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.